Hello everybody! Good evening, good morning, good afternoon, whatever it may be for you right now. I hope you're doing well. Punch it toward. How you all doing? We're back finally with some EPTP dp dreamy bros. I uh, hope you're doing well. I'm doing pretty good myself. Uh, glad to be back with this game. Let's smack this. Oh. Oh. Projection. Hello, who we got? Hello there, Rara Golden. Kel. Uh, oh, Amori. Um, hello, River. Danny. William. Hello, 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 hello. Hope you're doing well tonight. Bow. Oh, that's not in the background. What's in the background? What's these? That was a fake block. Understandable. All right, let's jump on the the dark block. Beep. Oh. Okay, he's sad now. <laughs> so the reason I thought I was like avoiding it, and then I realized, oh wait, the blocks. I probably should hit them. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's. That's very hard to work it. Aha! Whoop! Bow! Bow! Hello there, Verdant. EP and perhaps DP, exactly. EP and DP. Well, how are you doing this afternoon, or this evening, or whatever it may be for you all right now? I hope you're doing well. How was your How was your weekend? How was the beginning of your week? Uh, I had work, obviously, and, uh, oh, scary. So are they all fake? Uh, okay, I wanted to go fight them. You can use Luigi Nation in a place like this, but there does not seem to be room to maneuver. Luigi has ideas. What? Your mind has opened to yet another new shape? All right. Okay. Ball! Whoa, a ball. Can you move around using the cycle pad? Down the hill! Woo! <laughs> nice. Ha ha ha. So, well, my Monday was wild. Uh, my weekend was nice. Oh, and you can call me Rue or Rue for short. Fair enough, I'll try to remember chance that, Rue. Oh my goodness, chance time. Alright, a chance time. It's been a while, it's been a while. Let us do a chance time spin right here. Alright. Let me get up on the screen. Oh dear. Is it up on screen? Yes, it Wahoo. is. Alright, chance time spin. What's going to be our chance time? Boop. Ooh. Stretch. I will stretch. D damn! Oh my gosh, it's an awesome door called my. <laughs> Hello, Ashen. Stretch. Gold, did you stretch me again? Okay. <laughs> Hello, Togi. So, I saw on the Luma Discord someone suggested uh, that at the beginning of each stream, I should just do a free chance time spin. And I'll get opinions on that. At some point, I'll ask the Lumas as well. But did you, do you think that would be a good idea at the beginning of a stream or at some point during the stream to get a free chance time? You should, should. It was an interesting idea because I saw it and I'd be like, hmm, that would be a funny idea. Either that or like I could make a redeem that's like a one time, just like a hundred coins chance time. Uh, but there's only one per stream. Give us free stuff, Mr. Mike Tendo. 
Yeah, but if it lands on end stream, nothing happens. That's fair. I got so close to being this game, you never could. <laughs> Look at you, on a roll. Dreamy, with this shape, exploring will be a snap. Just a reminder, but to switch to the icon, you must press the R button, okay? To return to normal, press L and collapse and hit B. Me, 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 me. Woohoo! Wait, what's over there? No, no, something over there. No, no, no. What's over there? Is there really nothing over here? It's just a. Oh, okay. Oh. Start the stream ends <laughs> Uh, if you start free chance time and then go end stream, that would be fucking hilarious. It would be. There'd have to be a clause on uh, if if, if I get free ch or if I do free chance time. Uh, end stream should <laughs> should be like a uh, an actual thing that happens. If I do get end stream, though, that's gonna be like wow, the very low chance of end stream up happening has happened. Oh hello, Monday, Monday, delicious swim. Oh, okay, I'm up here now. Oh yeah, what's up? A dead end. Uh, not quite. I sense something. Hello there, Shadow Brandon. Monday. That's me in uh, Happy Home Paradise Loki. <laughs> Monday. Stacked in Pocky. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pocky is like one of the currencies you just get a bunch and a bunch and a bunch of. I haven't played Happy Home Academy. Well, I guess you got New Horizons DLC, which kind of is Happy Home Academy. I do like it, though. It is fun. What the hell? Whoa. I see. Ooh. <laughs> Wonderful. Wonderful. <laughs> By pressing the B uh, button, pops out a string of Luigi Noids. I sense that if you want to let it go, you can press the A button. Dreamy, you learned a new move. Learn how to ball and learn how to stretch from the ball. I wish Animal Crossing New Horizons was better. Animal Crossing New Horizons is such a it's such a mixed bag for me. I do wish the online multiplayer was better. Cause like, man, the online multiplayer having eight players but like having nothing to do is so upsetting. Spaghetti, I don't want money. I'm selfish. Where is it? I want the money. Give me. No, I missed money. No, I want the money. Money! <laughs> Woohoo! Alright. Why don't we start a free spin in this stream? Single player Animal Crossing New Horizons is peak single player Animal Crossing, in my opinion. Oh, yeah, single player Animal Crossing in New Horizons is probably the best Animal Crossing has been. It's just unfortunate that we had to suffer that the, the, the multiplayer is just not there. Why I didn't turn into a literal wasteland because I had never, I had, uh, had an idea, never finished it. That's New Horizons. I would love to like go back to new horizons like what i would have loved is if on new horizons you could like have an island online with other players like say for instance you have a specific island that you and your friends can go to but you can like create it the the, the, the inability to like move furniture and stuff with your with, uh, with your friends really hurts the game i i wish you could move the furniture move the stuff on the island with your friends over it's just oh Your eyes still being worked on. I should get. I should get Animal Crossing a visit one day again. It's been a while. Ow. Oh, I see. Ow. Double lucky. Damn, that's a lot of luckies on those blocks. Okay, I get it. I get it. Hehe. 
Oh, what off. Just gonna heal a little bit. I think at some point this year, though, I'm gonna restart my save. I want to experience the uh, start of the game again. The start of the game, yeah, the start of the game was something magical. It was very different. I love the start of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Just like trying to, I think one one of the memories I love about uh, early Animal Crossing is everyone scrambling to get clay to make the ocarinas. Like everyone wanted clay, and like. At some point, you don't really use clay. <laughs> Excuse me. That's free from there. Wow, just to hit that one null. Ba -da -ba -ba. Crazy how well Animal Crossing Rising did, probably because we're on the biggest games 2022. It released at the perfect moment for itself. Like, it, it, it releasing what it did was like perfect for its uh, launch. <clears throat> so, obviously, back then people couldn't go outside. So, people, you know, did their outside activities through Animal Crossing. Also, what I think added to the magic even more than New Horizons came out back in March 2022 was how united everyone felt, I guess. Yeah, that, that would have helped as well. Everyone just kind of living on this virtual world of Animal Crossing. It really did come out at the, the, the perfect time. Set up pictures for the first day. I think I do as well. One of my favorite early uh, clips from Animal Crossing in the early days was when I finally got an Ocarina and Kitty was on the island at one point. Uh, walking up to Kitty, just going Doop, and then walking away, and just see seeing Kitty's character slowly, slowly just go at me. It was so funny. I'll uh, do it this way. Uh, I'll fight this enemy. Oh, you. Come at me. Oh, I get a, I get a first attack. Ha! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, eight. Slow turns. What the fuck was it? Yeah, pretty much. It was just a slow turn to... What the fuck did you do? <laughs> it was so funny. Oh, yeah, more crossing was magical. Speaking of New Horizons... Ew. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get him. Woo! The music that played before the town hall was just the best. Yeah, it was so relaxing. Like, the music... I need to... I actually haven't gotten... After all these years, I've not gotten the music for Animal yeah, Crossing yet. we are superstars. Spooky hello, Mike and everybody, and welcome to my Nightmare Dream and Mario. <laughs> Nightmare Dream and Mario. Hello, Spooky Goth uh, Tomoko. Thank you for the 15 months. Much appreciated. God, it's, these months are. So, it's weird that I've been streaming for nearly two years on Twitch, at least. YouTube, I've been streaming. Oh, God damn it. Much longer. Uh, Bina, thank you so much. For me, any nightmare that has Mario just becomes a dream. <laughs> you know, at some point, I, I need to go back and, like, get the soundtrack of Animal Crossing. Die. 
die. Perish, perish, perish. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Ah! Oh. Oh, what have I done? What have I done? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Can I be bowling? Oh, I have to go down. Ah, I see. Oh, enjoy lucky stop it. Animal Crossing is the same time though. Has caused me an unprecedented level of grief. <laughs> yeah. Mario is gone. He's been consumed by the Luigi ball. One villager I won after nearly 2,000 plus tickets going from island to island. That, oh, that sounds pain. I also do also know that feeling of winding a villager and just not getting them. Super blanks. Who are you looking for, uh, Curious Ashen? I'm not sure if that's the way, so I'm gonna go up this way and can I go over here? Can I make them let go and go we? No, I cannot. Ah! Okay, so it's not that way. I'm gonna go off to the left then. What's your guys' favorite Animal Crossing villager? Mine is Goldie. Yes, I'm basic, but she's adorbs. Um. <clears throat> I pressed all the wrong buttons there. <laughs> Yo, thanks for saying that, Mike. <laughs> You're welcome, dude. Woohoo! I think mine was either maple or stitches. I don't know, Mesh Bears. My face, probably J. Oh, your favorite Loomis J Sky? That's very sweet. <laughs> Oh, no, no, I'm doing something wrong here. Let's go. No. Just to destroy that, I need to ground pound it. Oh, wait, hold on. Can I fit? Oh, I can probably fit under by doing this. I'm a derp. No, can I? No, wait, no, I can't. I'm just barely not big enough, or barely not small enough. Wolfgang. I feel bad because I have Wolfgang. <laughs> no! Muffy's my favorite next to Lucky. Mike, I'm sorry. I. <laughs> Who's Muffy? I don't think I've heard of Muffy. I like Stinky. Uh, that's one of my favorite. That's one of my first villagers. Fair. Um, how do I? I'm. Let me go down and go into the other room. Cause there's another room I can go into. Hold on. Muffy took off sheep. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know Muffy. What's this way? Okay, now I'm stuck. Okay, so now we learn something. Ugh, stuck. There we go. 
the best sheep ever. I love the goth sheep. <laughs> I'll be honest, two of my favorite villagers are Sucker and Alice. I know Sucker's an octopus. Who's who's Alice again? God, there's so many Animal Crossing villagers. Mario, what are you doing? <laughs> what? Truly? If you press the A button, you can swing the Luigi ball? Perhaps if you press A button again... <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Just yeet Luigi's a koala. Okay. <laughs> Is there no end to your powers? Shall we call it ball hammer? Let us break those as well. Come back, Luigi. <laughs> you threw my ball! <laughs> I just threw him. Can you aim lower and then hurl it? We have learned ball hammer. We can now just throw Luigi. Nothing can stop us now. Onward. Thanks, man. I'm gonna break these ones. Nyeh. I uh, have a fun stream, Mike. Back to work I go. Have a good rest of your day at work there, Spooky. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, just keep swinging. Uh, 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 uh. Nice. All right. I'm gonna switch to this one. Hi. Oh. Mm, mm, mm. Wow, I like, I like that uh, game I want to play again. Oh, well, uh, Dream Team? You know, I've been liking it so far. Uh, I've not completed it, so this is the first I've gotten, pretty sure. Oh my god, look at them. <laughs> one more thing, I love having the black luma. Bye. Yeah, no, that's the, that's the one year. I need, I should see, I think Jewel made them. I should see if Jewel can make the, because I think I have more badges for like more than one year or two year lumas. I'll have to see if I can get a different kind of luma for different luma badges. All right, we have made the guardian bird thing. I don't know what that says. That's the unknown speak. Some of it look like, uh, these symbols are Pilo characters. All right, can you translate for us, bud? All those who seek the sea keeper's power, UT, ulti bed, you must make the altar bed. The altar bed. It is constructed of five parts. The Pajamaja rock frame. It rests on Mount Pajamaja. Pajamaja ba 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 so excited for when I get uh, the Black Luma. They look silly. They're great. There was only one Black Luma in Mario Galaxy 1. That's why he was the highest ranking one for a long time. The dozing mattress sleeps in dozing sands. The must rise tree board rises in must rise fields. Driftwood jellyfish sheets drift on driftwood shore. The Sea Keeper's Feathers, an heirloom of Pilo Castle. All five parts must be assembled by the bedsmith. The bedsmiths will gather on Wake Isle. Find the five parts and give them a bedsmith. Only then can the ulti bed be completed. Mushrise Fields. That surely refers to Mushrise Park. And Wake Isle must be Wakeport. Do you agree? Oh. Mm -hmm. 
This is... A book? Ah. This pamphlet holds all the information I just translated. That's handy. Mario, will you hang on to it? You got the ultra bed manual. Yo, we're gonna make a bed, guys. I ain't done that since I moved into the hut. I made that bed. Well, I put it together. I didn't make it. I put it together, <laughs> shall I say? I sense that if Luigi sleeps on the altar bed, we will, f uh, we will find the dream world where the Z Keeper lingers. You can check the manual I gave you from the menu. Be at one with it and find all five parts. To lay eyes on the book you just received, select the guide. In the altar bed. Observe, a book icon has been added here. Yes, the altar bed manual, please select it. Okay. I see, they're all on the map now. Let's also keep a log of current events and details regarding the different bed parts. Once you've uh, become one with the information here, I ask you to close the menu. Okay, so that's the first one, the rock frame. So let's look, we're going back to Pajamaja rock frame. It's somewhere on Mount Pajamaja. Can you find it? Go there and search for clues. Okay. All right. Well, let's go back to Pajamaja Baja 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 Baba. We call this Minecraft. Wow. Ippy Bros, exactly. Yeah, we, we are the superstars. King Brent Monk Pog. <laughs> King Brent Mo Monk Pog. <laughs> Monkey. Yo, Soundway, thank you for the 12 months. That's a whole year. Congratulations on becoming the little black loomer. Is it the block guy? I don't voice him. Uh, that's a bean? I don't voice you. You hurt your own dog. I don't care if it's a red monster. Get out of here. No, 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 I don't care. No, you hurt your own dog. I don't care. I don't like you. You don't be voiced anymore. Yes, rumors have reached my ears of this beast. It is a rare type of monster that only exists in dreams. It is called the Golden Beanie. If the rumors are true, one who defeats it reaps great rewards. I have read, oh, I have heard tales of a coin supply that knows no end. Another tale speaks of a piece of almost mythical gear. Ugh. You commit animal abuse? Yeah! He hurt his own dog! No, no, I'm not voice you. I do not give a shit. No, no. You can speak all your French all you want. I do not care. No. Well, our priority must remain in the, the altar bed for the moment. But if we encounter one along the way, I say we try for it. Oh, yeah. Alright, random. Just, you know, hey, you should go defeat this monster. He is not allowed to bussing here. Yeah. Exactly. We don't like him. Na, 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 na. Where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? I would like to leave uh, the way down there. Where am I gonna leave? Why not that way? Oh, did I? I went the wrong way. I think I went the wrong way at least. Yeah, I just want to. I want to leave. Bye, bye, Dreamy Luigi. Ooh. Oh yeah, the sleepy guy. He talks like this. <laughs> Not her. So, how'd it go? Learn anything new? We are tasked with with scouring the island. Scouring the island. I can English. We must find the five parts of the altar bed. <laughs> As I'm sleeping on the bed will take you to the sick keeper. Is that... Five parts. 
become one with the altar bed manual on the menu screen. You should have to find all five parts scattered around this island. We must begin with the base, the Pajama Maja rock frame. It appears we can find it on Mount Pajama Maja Baja 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 Baba. All right, we should head to Mount Pajama Maja Baja 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 then. All right. To Mount Pajama Maja Baja 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 then. Off we go. Oh wait, they can use these pipes to go to Mount Pajama Maja Haba Jaba Baja Baba, hopefully. Uh, yes. Alright, let's start at the base and work our way, actually let's start at the peak and work our way down. Hello? Okay. Oh, hi. Hello, welcome to Mount Pajama Maja Maja Haba Jaba. You're in luck because there's a new Mount Pajama Maja Maja Haja Baba tour. Painstakingly crafted by the massive bros who summited Mount Pajama Maja Maja Haba Jaba, this tour is not for the faint of heart. In fact, you might never return. Wow! Advertisement! <laughs> if you think you have what it takes, by all means, take this thrilling tour. The massive bros await hardly souls at the midway point of the mountain. Okay, so we're gonna go back down again. Gotcha. My spiel aside, there is no way anyone will take this tour. It is a tour of pain. And seriously, making me lure people to some cold rock face like it's fun? That is the most nasty marketing. The tour center is remorseless. Alright guys, off to uh, see the massive bros so we can... Can I... 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 Okay. Let's say I can't get up there again, right? Wee. I don't think I would go on a tour where the advertisement was like, hey, you're not going to make it back. You're going to perish. What kind of tour would get you guys excited? If, if, if like there was a tour for something, what, what would be a tour you'd like to go on? For me, it'd be a tour of like gaming or like even Nintendo. Just big old Nintendo gaming tour. Like here is a uh, tour of the freaking legendary Nintendo stuff. Woohoo! Saving again because I like to. Oh, wow. A tour of gaming history, to be honest. Yeah, no, a tour of gaming history sounds really nice. Oh, let's go on a trip. Alright, heal ourselves. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I apparently I got behind Mario. Mario looked like. Ugh. Thank goodness he attacked Luigi. <laughs> Oh, get out of here, son! Whoop. Here they are. Lodge, bro! Da, small bro! New tour on mountain is genius stroke, but it's no tourist coming. It's weak, it's flabby. Small bro, have beef. Climbing man manics come soon. It's supposed to be manic tour. See, faith master is weak. It's climbing tourist right now. Beef time. You come for extra beefy tour, da? It's time to crush mountain with muscles of marble. Oh. 
is not tough for you. Wait, yeah, cut, let's listen. Its newest tour is amazing. Massive avert. Pajama Magic 2! Beef steak! Beef steak! Treasure tour! Uh, uh, uh. I sparkled with treasure word. Da. Massive bro, do not see it yet, but ultimate treasure hides on the mountain is the rumor. <coughs> I have a bunch of toad where is it? he was down there. But it changes, da. It's fun tour now. Da. Good day, Fort Hawk. Welcome to Beef Tour. Are you ready to go on Beefy Tour? Da. Come. <coughs> that voice is my hardest voice on this this uh, no, no room. Toy is full like sleeves of massive shirt, no space. Yeah. Oh. Uh. There's some fat foot on this man, see. But purple ain't really really a climbing tap. And these beef jerkies bring me along. Boo, boo, I say. Nobody stops the shadow thief, see? I'll hit that awake port house for revenge. Who cares about this stinking tour anyway? Have fun scrapping, scraping your knees up, you lousy drips. All right. Sugar beef. It's treasure time. We start tour now. So, yes, sir. <laughs> How you doing, Four Hawk? Hope you, hope you had a good rest. All right, what are we doing? You come. It's steep, da. It's precise piece. Oh, that is very steep. Mountain shows too beef now. We got beef for beef to survive. Sleep are good? Good to hear you good. I think he probably just woke up there for hot. It's time to muscle up. It's new skill time. Da, new technique made over 25 years. Ready, lunch, bro. Bring beef. Massive herbs. Super Beef Muscle Flex Ultra Special Double Ab Crunch Jump! AKA Pull Up! Uh, uh, uh. It's nice, da! That sounds like a meal. It does, yeah. Had to sleep in 25 plus temp, so yeah. Oh, uh, I know that feeling for. That is. <sighs> Horrible. It's perfect bra synchronization with ultimate ab flexing. It's possible to bounce off ground like toy ball of baby. Da, now cutlets. Press R three times to change action into ball hop. Both A and B buttons are same icon. Da, is nice. Cutlets can start with either button. Red guy starts first for this time. Press A and ball hop starts. You circle pad are nothing to move. It's good. Now cutlets, get up here and ball chain. It's perfect. Press A button for normal. We don't ball hop. Yay. Special move makes muscle turtle at mountain's cliff. Master ball, master ball. Master ball hop? Hop has a master ball? <laughs> Holy shit, they're balling. Master ball hop and a mountain cries for mercy. Da, we go on. We went ahead. Use ball hop to catch up. It's super. Wee, wee. We are absolutely ball ronin. Bean. 
It takes Master Blows 25 years to come up with move, and Cutlets master it in just seconds. It's madness. But abs must be iron to climb all the way. Da, we move. Tour just begins. And they're off. Cutlets. <laughs> they're so far away. Up here! Hi. You climb! It's boring waiting! Okay. Give me a give me a little bit. Just chill, okay? <gasps> Dr. Mario. Dr. Mario! You know, I wonder what these guys' diets are. Nothing but me. That is a lot of enemies. Um I'm not quite sure what I'm mean having to do here. Woohoo! Okay. Now. Bye, Mario. These guys are confusing me. <laughs> okay, let's think about it. I think if we get a line of the same color, they perish. Okay, he's back up. I want yellow. I see. Oh, I'm red now. I'm tiny! <laughs> oh yeah, we got secret boxes. Secret box! Go! Oh no. <laughs> Oh no! What have I done? <laughs> oh dear. Ow. Okay, now it's just him. So yellow turns to red, red turns to blue, blue turns to yellow. Okay, gotcha. That was a little bit dicey. <laughs> uh, falling down there. Won't get me stuck because I have the ball technique now. That was a battle of all time. It was, yeah. Oh, God. It's good. It's nice. 
He's nice. <gasps> Yoon, hi, sweetheart. Full of beef, we move up. Treasure is waiting, da. <laughs> How you doing, love? Hi, Kanari. Oh, this time I'm gonna fuck you up. Come here. I understand how you work now. I'm going to get you. Vibing. Oh, beautiful fiber. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, too early. Oh! Too early again. Ow! Okay. We have a lot of... Okay. And then... This will turn to a red. Oh, well that doesn't help. Mario, Luigi is gone. Luigi! Na, 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 na. These guys are gonna take me out a lot. Oh my god. So good to keep coming in voice, Mike yourself for it. Yeah, sure, I'll join you off this battle. Well, if I, hit, if I hit someone once, I want to hit them with a hammer and not a jump. I'm stupid old. Reds. Can I even hit him with a hammer? Hold on. I can. Good. Oh, he turned. Get an eye. Silly. Bonk. Now he's red. Now he's dead. <laughs> did Luigi take a thousand damage? It looked like he did, didn't it? I think he took a hundred. I'm good to join voice call now, sweetheart. Hold on, let me go into it. There we go. I'm in there now if you wish to join me, love. The Germa from Dr. Mario. Yep, and they're a lot more difficult than what they were in previous games they appeared in. Hello. Hello, sweetheart. I need to add you to the title now. You don't have to. I'll keep the title. There you go, guys. Now she's in the title, so you can click that nice little at Unilever yes. Arts and Yoga. Give her some love as well. Follow her on Twitch. Give her a follow on everything else that she's on as well. Uh. Hey. Okay. Out there. Never. Yeah. How are you doing, though, love? I am by a bin. I've been uh, organizing some files again. Fair, fair. I've been battling. You know, I'm. Mm -hmm. Placing some screenshots in different folders because I realized like, oh, I should probably do that. Gotcha. 
No fair fair. Um Okay, what turns to what again? I forget what I forget the colour water again. Oh. Yellow turns to red, I'm pretty sure. Please. Yes. Perish. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, it turns to red, which means I bonked this one twice. How's stream been Boop. going? It's been good. We've got our next mission. We have to go find and build a bed. The ultimate bed. Nice. Bolt Cerulean 7 says, I remember these bugs. You remember the bugs? The bugs, you say? Oh. The bugs? Bugs. I understand how these enemies work now. It's like Dr. Mario. You line them up in a line of three and they go bleh. Now there's only one oh. left. I'm going to smack you. <laughs> So what are you right now? Are you doing more folder organization? Yep. Nice. First build a bear, <laughs> now build a bed. <laughs> Sorry, go on. I cut you off there, sweetheart. No, I'm fine. I'm good. Oh, chat. I just realized chat was like, you know, it's you know. Oh, they've got some of them got the bonging ham. Your, your poogie, basically, the hamu. Oh, yeah, the little, little bongo hamu. Go for it. Bongo hamu, yeah, let's go. Yes. Support the yoon, yes, yes. Never. You know, I finished the commission, so. I saw. It looks very nice. It looks very nice. You know, uh, the commissioner was very happy. I even got I got a tip, so Ooh. that was unexpected. Oh, that's so cool, though. You deserve mm. it. I'm surprised Mike hasn't been to build a bear. They do have licensed Mario outfits. <laughs> we had a build a bear once in the in the city near me. It's gone now, like most shops. <laughs> A lot of shops did not survive the uh the pandemic now. The Konono. We used to have one and I wish it was still there, because when, when Yuna came over, uh it would have ow ow ow. It would have uh had Mimikyu. <laughs> So she could have built a Mimikyu. Mario is currently perishing. What the hell? That's a fly guy in the background. Well, I'm healing myself first, then I'm going to attract that fly guy over here. With the fly guy airship. Alright, Luigi. Oh, you! <laughs> they, that was it. They perished. Oh no, the ship perished. They're still. Well, they're. I think they're alive. Yes, they are. <laughs> okay. Now we've got some shy guys here, gentlemen. Of us. Oh goodness. The shy guys tickled us. He tickled? They tickled. They, they, they're they running at us and their little tickle, tickle, tickle hands out. Damn. I remember there was a builder bear at a large shopping center at Lakeside. We had, we had a builder bear like literally in, in the mall where I live, not close, not, not far from mine. And uh, it was there for a while. I think, I can't remember if I, I went in there, but I didn't build anything to keep myself, but they did have some nice stuff in there. And obviously, like I said, like you said, there'd been Mario stuff as well. There would have been like a Build-A-Bear Mimikyu in there, which, would have, which I would have took Yuna to go do. Sad to hear it go. Yeah, same. A lot of shops just are gone. Yeah, a, lot, a lot of unique cool shops are gone, but then we just keep getting more clove shops. Yeah, yeah, kind of feels that way. It's like, it's cool and all for the clove shops, but do we need this many?
You have around 18 builder bears. <laughs> Fiending for them builder bears. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's this? Da! Ah! Large bro, is impossible. Go it's through the ring really without touching. It's solid talk. It's weak. You give up on top? Maybe jump must be soft like this. Well, he didn't touch the ring, but... I got one of my screenshot drawings, things, um... Mimikyu Menace now. Mimikyu Menace. Lodge Mimikyu. Ball is stupid pose. It's like eggs without a bacon. That's a Sonic ring. That actually has a Sonic ring. Ah! Cutlets! What was Massive doing is important to work. Where to treasure is behind door, is fury anyway. But door stay closed, is real brain buster. Ring seems like key, but no, massive failure. But maybe small muscles mean big heads, da? If cutlets open door, then they keep mounted treasure. Massive bro, help, head, muscles, flex. Hmm, I'm going to learn my new ball technique. Ah, exactly. Oh, I messed it up. It was meant to go into the... <sighs> Damn, okay. I see, I see. Whoop. Oh, no! I see, okay. Well, it's different each time. Random, nice. Whoop. Okay. Aha! We're making it into the dreams of this one. Exactly, a beer. Hello, welcome. Go into the special stage. <laughs> Unbeefable. Un un Unbeefable. Un be beef. Door open. We knew little cutlets had inner beef. Who knew? Who? But who knew cutlets were mountain manics? Massive bros give respect with meaty gift. I don't want your meaty. Oh, okay, that is that is a new attack piece. Okay, thanks, man. New bro attack. What do we get? Slide and hold the circle pad down and draw back. H hold the B button and aim. Oh boy. All right, let's see what this one's about. It's getting so many notifications on Twitter. On Twitter. Twitter. Twitter.com. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh no, it's a motion control. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. You ready for motion control? Wait, I need to. Okay, well, uh. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna be using this attack, bros. <laughs> he completely missed! Alright, now we're getting there, yeah. Mike, bust out the Switch Pro controller. <laughs> Thanks to Lowe's for that art piece. Oh, yeah, the RPG post in the Luma Discord. I saw that. That was really well done. My chair is merely composed of cat and dog pictures, funny game clips, and cool art, and nothing else. Kind of similar to mine, Canari. Mine has a lot of dogs and cats being silly art that people retweet, or just art in general, mostly Mario, um, or Red Lately Peach. Uh, yeah, no, just a lot of cool stuff, actually. But treasure must be near, da! Da! Come! Thank you for the hydrate. I'm receiving love help. Nah, people deserve love. People deserve kindness. People deserve just to, you know, have gifts sometimes.
Master Bro have never been this part of mountain. We must stay so cutlass must hard as eat up beef and go on. Okay. We are big talk guys, da! So we will stay for research. Come, let's go on with adventure. Do not worry about the massive bros. That massive bro. I'm gonna heal Mario just in case. Oh, Luigi's a little bit hinting on it. Finally go around to updating the link to my game. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna smack it with my hammer. That didn't work. I'm gonna ball. Don't work either. I'm gonna wait. Ball over here. Aha. Uh -huh. I found it. Wait. Oh. Oh, we found it. There he is. There's part of the bed. Is this the mountain's treasure? That shape. It must be the pajama maja ha baja baba jama maja maja frog frog frame. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Is treasure? Is legendary frame. Frame actually exists. Yeah, it's ours. Hey, thanks for guiding us all the way up here. No need for thanking. It's pinnacle of talk and life. We regret nothing now. Wow, that attitude. You guys are solid. Massive bros, check out area for good wine. Treasure is yours. Go forth and beef. Uh, thanks. Well then, I guess we can get going. Wait! Kanaru 5 oh. says it's Mount Pajaj Maj 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 Nam Nam Jan Bahamas bed frame. Luigi, get to sleep. <laughs> Thank you for making Jonathan go through Bahama Jam Nam Jam Nam Jam Dreambert, what's up? This is indeed one of the sea parts we seek. There is no doubt it is the Pajama Marja rock frame. However, clear your mind and truly see it. It's petrified by a nightmare chunk. Now that you mention it, it does look ominous. In that state, we shouldn't use it to make the altar bed. Well, there's only one real way to cleanse it. Sleep on it. Ah, I get you. We go into the dream world and break that chunk. Correct. It appears to be our only choice. Mario, Luigi, do your best. Oh my goodness, guys, we're eeping in the dream game. Who would have thought? Mount Slam's keyboard. Thank you, yes. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you know how much I love you? <laughs> <laughs> I love you very much too. You get wholesome. Yeah, more you give to the meat. I'm going to get you in the eye. What? Yeah. <laughs> I broke her. You broke me. <laughs> Help me. Mike broke me. <laughs> oh, well, I found the, the piece. It's in there, but. Hmm. Would you enjoy jumping into someone's dreams? Ah, uh, if I physically went there, I guess it depends on the person. I wouldn't want to just go into anyone's dreams. Would you pop into my dreams? Oh, yeah, all the time. Oh, I was not looking. It's, it's untimed. I wasn't looking at all. Oh, uh, go. <laughs> ah, I got punched. <laughs> I'm away. Go, go, go. Luigi. <laughs> Luigi. Lukey. I will not be trying by the box. Oh, Luigi, no! Go, 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 go! Ow! Oh, god damn it! Oh! No! Oh, I was right there! Sadness. Alright, we got this, we got this. Okay. Cool. I'm going. I'm going. Alright. Wee. <laughs> You're getting punched in that level, I see. I was getting punched, yes. Don't you dare- No! I'm, I'm, I'm too impatient! Fuck! 
Luigi. I just thought that you freaking posted my stream in the stream archive no. from yesterday. <gasps> so close. Too oh dear. Special. What do you mean? I don't do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I also ended that with 0.30 seconds left. Oh, Luigi, every time. How you doing, by the way, Terry? All right. Uh, down we go. Woohoo! Oh, then mind if we didn't go down far. <laughs> Do I need to swing the Mario? Yes, yes I do. Swing the Mario. Swing the Luigi, sorry. The ball of Luigi. Yes! The ball of Luigi. <laughs> the nightmare chunk around the frame should be gone now. Let us return to the real world. Thanks, Would you man. swing the Mario ball? Would I what? Would you, would you swing a Mario ball? A Mario ball. Hmm. I've not come across a ball that has a, a leash to swing on with Mario. I guess the closest thing would be, uh, what's it called? Uh, Mario Pinball when I get to it. Doing good. Uh, oh, yeah, you have to do that. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> yep. Ha. Doing good, figuring out my V2 and model tech. I'm getting into editing videos to make content, tutorials, and shit posts. Ooh, <laughs> that sounds cool, Terry. Yeah, I wish you the best with all that. When it comes to VTube, I am I am clueless. You, however, would be very obviously new. No I'm just saying here, like Terry, please hand me over some of the. I'm very doing very slow progress on like my debut stuff in general. So, huh? You, you, you're you're doing all your stuff yourself, though. You aren't you? You're making you're making your model all kind of stuff. Oh well, yeah, I am. I am a. <laughs> I'm a one man artist. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds good. Hold on, let me talk to Terry that. That would be handy. You know, that, that does sound handy. You got the Paja Maja rock frame. Also, hello there. Uh, the the tick break. Hello. Thank you for the follow, by the way. I can't believe you could... I can't believe... Ugh, let me start again. I can't believe that <laughs> could happen to one of the parts. How could it get hit by a nightmare chunk? The chunks flew everywhere when Antasma broke the stone. One must have flown here and landed directly on it. Well, thank heavens we got it back to normal. Yes, this is fortunate. It is now safe to use. Very well, we must seek the next part of the bed. Yep, let's keep this good feeling going. Let's hunt. Remember the menu has info. Yes, I know the menu has up. <sighs> All good, Canari. I can also teach you how to make a visual indicator that uses your favorite font. I'm back now. <laughs> Welcome back. Ooh, my favorite font would definitely be the uh, the Mario font that I use for like everything in like in, well, in my videos and stuff. And that sounds cool though. It it definitely sounds handy to have John be like, "There's an ad coming," <laughs> or John. Yeah, no, I guess. I, I, I'm not sure. Twitch seemingly ramped up the whole thing. I remember Donnie was really struggling as well while I was playing Slay the Princess yesterday. Of like, mm. at least it was a slow game. You know, I I could like pause in between to make yeah. sure that we're back. Fucking <laughs> ads, man. Body ads. I so that you can <gasps> not turn them off, or you know, just say that you want ads at the beginning when someone clicks on your stream. Like I think yeah. I swear I set my ads to be not as common, but it Twitch just seems to ignore that sometimes. It's getting jumped by those ads. <laughs> I have returned. Welcome back, Golden. Check out DM to see what I mean. You'll want the thing at the bottom of the image. Let me have a look. Uh, oh, yeah, I see. Your auto ad starts after going live two minutes. I see. Yeah, no, that that, that does look very handy, actually. Boop. Bros bean. B 
been to the bros. Okay, I had to wait back down. But there was something else. Hold on, I saw there was another way that I could go further somehow. Yeah, there's a block. Oh, bros wear. Okay. Let's see what this is. I haven't changed my gear in a while. Let's see. You were getting jumped by those ads, though. You were really struggling with it. They, they just... Bolt Cerulean 7 says maybe for the next He's Mario the and you. Luigi RPG, they will have the main Yoshi with a custom hat and gloves as a new ally. Honestly, if the Mario and Luigi RPGs were still, like, going, I, I'm surprised they never did a Mario RPG where Yoshi was, like, the next or your other teammate. That sounds, that sounds cool, actually. We lose HP, get bros, and defense. Oh, that's a path to trade off. Luigi's actually the healthier bros. So I'm gonna give this to him. Yeah, I'm tired of having to search and scrap both Reddit and YouTube for simple stream stuff, so I'm gonna teach folks how to have quality of life stuff. That sounds really helpful, actually, because the amount of times I've had to, like, either search up things to help with streaming, and there just isn't anything, or, like... I have to hit my head against the wall trying to... Luigi, no. <laughs> Luigi fell. I have to hit my head against the wall trying to figure out what the hell's gone wrong with stuff and just to just to find out I've done something. Now, that sounds really helpful, uh, Terry. I'll be sure to make sure people who are getting into streaming see that... Ah! See that kind of stuff so they can actually have a bit of help getting into it. I should ball. Oh, Luigi, come down here. Don't hit the bike, it's not good. Um. Okay. I have to watch a shitty 10 minute clickbait video for a minute answer. Yeah, that too. Luigi, no, I know Luigi just perished. Luigi was like, ah! <laughs> Fell. I need to find a. Oh! I'm looking what I'm doing. So I'm just so distracted by Yoon. <laughs> <laughs> She's so pretty. <laughs> Where's a pipe? Where is a pipe? I need to find a pipe. You do not even see me. I can imagine you though. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, if this is a shop here, I can buy some mushrooms. I haven't had mushrooms. Mushies? Mushies. Oh, wait, I can go up here now, right? Ah! Nice. Alright, quick go to the shop so I can buy some mushrooms. Uh, items. Mike with the oblivious risk technique and see you. <laughs> doing the race. If I can have any excuse to give you a compliment, I will take it. Ultra you are being very wholesome. Get wholesome. <laughs> what did I do to deserve me? <laughs> Be a lovely, wholesome, talented, and amazing person. You asked for it. <laughs> yeah. It's more like I didn't do anything special today. Yeah, you did. What I do respectful. <laughs> I, <of course. laughs> <laughs> I I will keep them and respect respectfully. That is a good one. <laughs> Each time that we're gonna continue with the Mao Mao anime, we're just gonna Mau you know he tries to raise her respectfully. up respectfully. <laughs> Respectfully declines. <laughs> <laughs> I need to draw Mama at some point, though. Yeah, Mama was adorable. Mama is so fucking adorable. She's so full oh, okay. of sass. I love it. She is. I know the sass on that character is amazing. What's the anime actually called? Because we, we, we just call it Mau Mau. <laughs> yeah, I think it was called the yeah, um, Apothecary Diaries, basically. Yeah. I, I hate the word Apothecary because I... I can't pronounce it properly. Why do it's they not call it or something? <laughs> yeah, I know it's an awkward but, ass word. Actually, what are we looking for next? So I'm just calling, and I think it's simpler for you as well because we know exactly what we mean when we call it 
Mau Mau. Yeah, watching uh, that with my- because I wanted to watch it because I've seen scenes and Mau Mau is fucking hilarious. So, uh... I feel like everyone's petty, even freaking Chinchi is over the top. He's trying so hard to <laughs> rip her up and she just... <laughs> What episode did we get to again? Was it like 10? I think we won episode 10? Yeah, I think yeah. around 10. The Sea Keeper statue claims the dozing mattress lies hidden in dozing sands. Where in the vast region could it be? All right, let's so we're going to dozing sands next. But yeah, there there is a lot of like uh, petty ladies in that show, and then Mao Mao just comes around, and be like, "I will fucking murder you." <laughs> Mao Mao about to teach you all a lesson. Yes. Dozing sands. That's great. Oh yeah. All right, dozing sands. We're off to the desert again. Alright, so we're gonna have to look for places where we can use our new techniques to get somewhere. Ooh, you wanna get somewhere? Yes, we're looking for another piece of the altar bed. The ultimate bed to go honk shoe. Uh, let me check the map actually real quick, see where... Where the fuck did uh, I get my kitchen, Nari? Where is the right. kitchen? Nari? Guess we're fighting. You could have lived peacefully, but you have chosen to perish. Two hundred damage. What oh, mushroom am I out? No spoilers, but the perfume at this chef's kiss. I think. I have seen maybe a scene or because I've seen a bunch of some scenes here and there from like other episodes I've not seen yet, which is why I got into this anime. But uh, like I said, I live for Mao Mao, and anything Mao Mao does is immediate like hell yeah. So Mao Mao is yes, we love Mao Mao in this house. <laughs> we, we love Mao Mao in this house. Yes, I wish I was half. I had half her sass that she has. I wish. I wish. Ah, we can ball up here, balling. I love how terrifying she is to the other uh, ladies in waiting as well. She just scares everyone. <laughs> yeah, that fact, and the way she just. Caught, like bluntly talks about it. again like the the very first episode she was like oh well i i just got kidnapped now i'm working here yeah yeah nonchalantly like excuse me you just were kidnapped you could have been sold you know anywhere considering the time period mm -hmm. you know she 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 could have been escorted or anything forced to you know Do a and lot. she just not want to like yeah well i tried my best i got kidnapped yeah, got my car, got, got kidnapped that well. Excuse me? Excuse me? Mau Mau. Mau Mau. Mau Mau. Mau Mau. Hello, Flame. Oh. Oh, I had Jewel voice this character. And she was just all. I can't remember the voice Jewel gave her. Oh, well. You! Cut! Why in the world are you doing? Wait, move the ancient hours! S -s Sorry, ma'am. It's just the wall is really hard and thick. I gotta say, I think breaking through this is impossible. Shut it! Shut it. Pathetic. Oh, wow, wow, right? Can't break it, right? Well, here's an idea for you, you giant babies. Just go over it, huh? How simple is that? Just. Matter? Do the job! Oh, yes! <sighs> this ain't gonna work. Forget it. Just keep working over there. Yes, boss. Damn. Oh, hey, boys. What's going on? Well, we hear a dead stupid end. <laughs> they look jewel coded. Yeah, jewel voiced this character before. I can't not remember the voice she gave her. It's like when you have a character that has like a, a very re like a recognizable voice and then they get a new voice for it. It's just like, who the hell is this? <laughs> Different character. 
can't walk on the far side because of this giant wall. And I am feeling some treasure just over it too. I wish we could just like boing over it or something. Hmm, I wonder what we need to do. Yeah, right, when Goombas fly. Anyway, Krausen, Grusen, Grausen, Grusen, won't solve it. I'm gonna stop <laughs> wasting the time daydreaming and get to work. Die, Luigi, we can bounce. Hell yeah. The Dr. Mario enemies are back. Oh, she's still around? Yeah, no, she didn't die. Oh, well, she, she did deliver oh, quite a funny scene when uh, we thought she died. <laughs> it was quite funny. I ain't dead, you fools! Um, okay, I think that one's going to turn yellow up, red up here. Yep. That's a row down. Okay, there we go. Nice. Uh, okay. All right. Get the other one. Oh, we can't really make any snacks. We just got him all. Oh, I missed. There we go. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, give it some of these guys. They'll turn to red. Alright, back with an AC on at uh, like 840. I love humidity. Welcome back for you. know, hopefully it gets better for you. Um, you weren't here for it, Yoon, but Four said they woke up uh, after a rough sleep because it was like 25 degrees sleeping wise. And it's like, god damn. Uh, uh, nice. Reminds me of freaking summertime last year. Uh. It was awful. Like, yeah. sleeping in 25, like, anything above 15 sleeping in for me, it's just, it just feels awkward. Now I remember as well, like, last summer I also, like, struggled to sleep, because it's like, <clears throat> it was way too hot to sleep with a cover, but the problem was when I didn't sleep with a cover, I would somewhat get sick or, like, catch a cold, yeah. nonetheless, because of the sweating, I think. I did find out the trick that I'm gonna do this year of like having just a very light cover over myself. Like a much lighter, lighter cover. Yeah, instead, instead of like an actual full on bed mm -hmm. cover, like maybe a duvet or something like that, something smaller. Yeah, because it sucks as well when you have like the covers, it's you're sweating so much, you wake up and it's like, ugh. Yeah, yeah, it's just, uh, oh, I hate one of, the, one of the things I really hate in the summer is waking up in like a pool of your own sweat. It's just so fucking annoying. <laughs> It just feels icky. We can play about summer heat? Yeah. Also, welcome back in our Yes, we are. Wonderful <laughs> summer sucks. Yeah, I dislike summer. What the hell? Yes. Oh, I see. Oh, I see what they're doing. Okay. Alright. I see which one stole my money. It's this one. Give me. Give me my money back. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Boop. Boop. Yes, give me Monday. Houses in UK are built for the cold, not the heat, right? Yeah. Uh, that's why I think it wasn't as bad in the current house I'm in because it's, oh, that's a fake, uh, because it's made of wood, so it's not as bad, but yeah, no, uh, UK houses are very much built for, um, installation, so they keep the heat in quite easily, so goddamn, when the summers get hotter and hotter over here and the heat's getting kept in, it is a pain in the ass. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm impatient. Oh, totally. Oh. The impatience yeah. is striking. I may be a little bit impatient. Cold makes me immobile. See, I 
for me, I'm like the opposite. I am better in the cold than I am in the heat. Like, my, my clothing doesn't change from... Uh... Like, at all. I, I wear a t-shirt all year round. I don't wear anything long sleeve because I don't feel the cold as much. Um, so I, I thrive in the cold. Whereas in the heat, ha, oh, I'm just gone. <laughs> Absolutely gone. So I, I've been told throughout my life that I am literally a walking hot water bottle. Yep. Yeah, you you are. I can. <laughs> I can. Uh, <laughs> I'm you, Yoon, you yeah, you you can attest to that. I am a walking hot water bottle. I would not know how Canadian houses are made. Cold. Just wrap. Just wrap up warm. <laughs> All right. How, what's the solution to heat? Alright, we're stuck again. Woohoo! Hmm. Oh. There we go. In the cold, you can just lay a. Uh, Close till you're comfy, but in the summer you can only get so naked. <laughs> Holy shit, Luigi Ball. Yes, we have a Luigi Ball. AC or insane amount of fans. Yeah, I don't have enough money to avoid an AC. I have a fan, it's on the uh, desk with me. Um, but I find the thing, obviously, with fans and AC, especially when it comes to recording and streaming, hot does the background noise make it a pain. <laughs> Speaking of which, June, since I've done the audio today for the uh, video, <laughs> um, you and Snake are pretty much spot on. Uh, Snake only had to lower a little bit. Your audio was fine. Um, obviously, I heard me. I can hear me in the background because, mm -hmm. yeah. But I'll, I'll be able to adjust that anyway. I'll be able to cut out when I'm when you're not speaking to not line or to line up, so at least you can't hear me. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I need to. Look yeah, into no, that's all fine. We'll, we'll we'll get you something. Um, but you know, in terms of that, apart from like the game being on the same audio track as me, annoying, um, everything else audio wise is fine. Snake's a lot better now. I'd, I'd, I'd have to turn down Snake minus 12, it's like minus 3, so you know, big improvement. Ooh, video project? Yes! Uh, a lot of us, six of us, played uh, a game. Haha. -ha. <laughs> Too early, I'm impatient. But no, we did a six-player game. Uh, we recorded it last Sunday. Ye mm, the Sunday before, I think. The Sunday before, Sunday yeah. Before. Ooh, that the rope one. Lethal Company, not Lethal Company, no. Park? Wrong game. Well, wrong name. I think you mean Pico Park. Pico Park? Welcome back to Why Did I Open Splatoon 2 for some reason. Why, why did you open Splatoon 2? That, <laughs> that's a fantastic question. Yes, Pico Park. Yes, Pico Park. That, that is indeed the game we recorded. Pickle Park. Pickle. Go. 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 I was just having a Splatoon 3, but when I saw the loading screen, I went, hang on. <laughs> Click the wrong Splatoon game. Oh, 
every stage, every weapon. We did do every stage, every weapon, no. Uh, we'll save it for like either next, like if we do it again, or um. But we did, we did some some. Ow, I'm not paying attention. We didn't do every stage, no. That would have been too long. But maybe we can yeah. go back to it at some point if we do another mm. video on it. My, I mean, Mike also is the one that edits this, so uh, it needs to be comfy for him to edit. I have the proof, I have the screenshot. <laughs> Splatoon 2. What? I wonder what Splatoon 2 is like right now online. It's probably the same thing. It's probably just missiles everywhere. <laughs> or Stingray. God, do you guys remember Stingray? What were they thinking with that? <laughs> hmm, good question. Like, Stingray was bad at the beginning, and then they said, fuck it, let's make it broken. <laughs> Study the elevation pattern, time your launch accordingly. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah! We, we are the superstars! Hey. Hey, hello, Ninquil. Thank you for the 12 months. Oh, congratulations, you're now a black Luma. Whole year Luma. Thank you so much for the year, subs year support. And Dengama? Oh, yes, Dengama too. Yeah, thank you so much, dude. Me for being stupid. Bombs! Wah! Nice. Welcome, how are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you doing? Still, or some stingray to some extent looks at uh, stinger from Salmon Run. Oh, douche ray. <laughs> at least he doesn't power up when he's shooting for a specific time. <laughs> like that one buff they gave to stingray made it go from like a niche sort of like special that doesn't really do much to the most broke, one of the most broken and annoying specials in Splatoon 2. Doing right, just hunting shinies in Scarlet. Ooh, hope that goes well for you. Any particular Pokemon you're looking for? Okay, it's higher up places. GG handshake special, special on tower control. I know Splatoon 3 has tower control handshake ones, like Tri Strike, Booyah Bomb still. Um, but Stingray was. Oh. Whatever I don't, uh, whatever I don't have that shows up in outbreaks. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah, fire! <laughs> Triple ink strike and Booyah should just bounce off the tower. <laughs> I guess that is really the only cheese for tower control is that if you throw those specials at the tower, you kind of just win if a teammate just jumps on at the same time, if it's an overtime. But that's only really an overtime. That's only during the overtime part if it's like pure cheese. Um, bouncing off would be weird. <laughs> what would you say is the most balanced mode in Splatoon? Uh, oh. Yeah, then again, Kraken. True. Sure. 
Crack Engelbert. Do they nerf Kraken on tower control specifically? Mm -hmm. I think they made it so you can like make it fall off easier. Like if you shot it, it had more knockback on the tower specifically. He hit what he hit me? I'm shocked. Took the bloody money. Yeah! We, we are superstars! Hey hey Mike and everybody, and I can catch your stream again and no work for me today and tomorrow. Ooh, no work for you today or tomorrow? Nice, Kanada. Thank you for the 20 months of being a Luma. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Hope to hear, oh, I hope you are uh, relaxing, vibing, having a good time there, Kanata. It's good to see you. Your friend Spooky was around earlier, but they're at work at the moment. Doesn't help the Kraken shielding. Also made it so in clan blitz, if a person turns into a Kraken, they they lose their clams. Yeah, they did they did do that. That doesn't stop the cheese though. <laughs> yes, I am Mike, and I, uh, she texted me and told me, "Hey, I'm glad to hear you doing well, there, Kanata." Kraken can just yoink the Rainmaker. It can yoink the Rainmaker, but at least you turn back into normal kid. Could you imagine if you? took the Rainmaker as Kraken and you stick Kraken. I win. Okay, we get stopped here. This isn't really anything here. Oh, okay, A, B, high. Okay, so that is... Kraken should be able to grab Rainmaker. Should or shouldn't? I mean, I think it's fine that Kraken grabs Rainmaker. I don't see no problem with it. Might cancel the special, but... <laughs> you gotta know when to use it. Tactical that counters clam jump cheese. How so? Tactical that can be placed as a wall. That is very specific. <laughs> Jumper spot is so to go. Place one in front of the jump spot to block the ball. It gives you enough time to splat. That is a very specific counter to uh, jumping in with a ball. And it also just waste tactical. Is that a counter to cheese or is that a counter to tactical? It's just to jump in and be like, half a mega ball! Wooga booga! <laughs> So, if only splash. Did the splash wall work like that? Oh, too early. Okay. No? Why not? They should make it so splash wall. That would be an. In Actually, that would be an interesting, like, niche to give splash wall. They should make it so if there's a splash wall in the way, you can't throw a. Like, an enemy can't throw a ball through it. 
that would give Splash Wall like a new niche and a new reason for people to actually run it. Oh, then again, that would buff pencil. Because <laughs> it has Splash Wall. Oh, <laughs> mm. <gasps> rank up. Oh, yeah. Rank up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> it boosts power by like it hits to deliver 200% normal damage. Makes mushroom give experience while well, it's HP. Mushroom lovers have their work up easy. Casual bros. Oh, wait, you guys started a hype train? I didn't even know. Oh, I missed the train. <laughs> Thank you for the hype train, anyway. Thank you. Oh, random. Do you know the snack buggles? I do not know. I've, I've not heard of that. The, that would buff Gal, both Gals. That would buff both the Gals. So I'm wondering what is the extra work rotation is like. It's Splash, S Splash, Dynamo, and Squiffer on Maruna's Bay. Very interesting um, set they've given it. Making 96 Deco the best clan weapon. Oh, yeah, because it'd have Wall and Kraken. Oh, never mind. Maybe, maybe don't do that with Splash Wall. <laughs> There are crispy corn snacks shaped like cones. Might only be in America, not sure. Oh, that's the first time I've heard of it. Sounds nice, though. <laughs> ah, bollocks. I wanted to make him yellow. Well. Eh, it's working out. It's song good. <laughs> Music to my ears, just like your voice. <laughs> Found a bag of cinnamon toast crunch flavored ones at the store the other day. Wanted to share their existence. I've looked at. Wait, so what were they called again? You said they're called. Snack. Buggles. That does not sound for me. It sounds like an American thing. Snack. Buggles. I'm looking these up now. Uh, oh, the shape looks familiar, but I don't think they're called that over here in UK. I have no idea what they're called in UK. Huh. They're, they're literally like a, clo like a cone. That's interesting. Huh. If, if I ever see one in the shops, I'll have to give them a try. We have an American, like, sweets and crisps store in the city at some point, although all the stuff in there is very expensive. <laughs> Pizza and tomato sauce flavored Pringles exist. Wait, do they? I want to try that. For no good reason? No, I want to try it. Rank up for Mario! Yeah! He's the rank up time! Woohoo! Bum 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 bum. Oh, Mario's gotta have the jump man power up. He's literally jump man. Is good. You tried them before, Kanada? I found some in. Uh. Grancaria. Five years ago, goddamn. That's a bit ago. Yeah. 
You mean what's your favorite crisps? Mm, crisps. Ooh, I like obviously regular crisps. Sour cream crisps are also pretty nice. Oh, sour cream are good. Hang on. That this shiny rock. Such a mysterious color, all glowy and pretty. This is an extremely rare type of mineral called dozing ore. I'm sure it is called dozing ore. I will pet the wumper. Thank you, sweetheart. He's a good boy. Let's get a good stretch. Thank you, Yuna. You giving me the self care. Good posture begins with <laughs> yes. a strong base. I'll make sure you're all <laughs> nice and hydrated. <laughs> and then Kanari's like punch toad. Yes. Wahoo! Can I sleep don't there? Oh, what dozing ore? Sorry. Complete the holy five. The holy five point redeems. Yep, the holy five. Water penetrates the ore and distills it within it. It leaks back out what it has, what we know as dozing drops. Wow, trickling down over a long time span, turning into something new. Nature is so so awesome. Dreamper, you know pretty much everything about this island, huh? I suppose that's correct. It is my home. I know it well. Allow me to illustrate that with one more important detail. When the dozing drops become solid, they form into dozing mattress, which is what we're looking for. What? So that means it's below this rock? Did my message about walkers not go through? Uh... No, it did not. I did not see a message about walkers from you. Mario, Luigi, you must press upward. The dozing mattress is somewhere below. Twitch moment? Yeah. We need another health redeem that just wellness check. Check your breathing. Relax and eat some soup. <laughs> eat some soup. <laughs> Buckles are made by walkers in the UK. Okay, I know of walkers. Understandable. I have to keep my eye out. We're almost there, let's hurry! New soup! <laughs> smack you, son. We'll smack you, son. Get back here. We'll smack you, son. I hit the bomb? How do you eat or drink soup? Oh, do you eat or drink soup? Uh, you slurp it. That is the true answer. You slurp your soup. You go... I guess it's a mixture of both, because there might be some chunky parts in the soup that you have to choo-choo, and there might be non-chunky parts that you go sip-sip. Sip-sip. Exactly. Some parts you have to go crunch-crunch, some parts you have to go... Like a song stuck in my head now for some reason. What song? The one uh, from Aspen of like, you're a loser. Oh, the <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's such a funny, <laughs> funny song. So I have a legitimate question about slurping stuff because I've had this argument with my family for ages. All right, go on the national. What, what, what is it? Fair added protein. Okay, important question. Do you bite or chew ice cream? I lick it. <laughs> if you have a hot drink, do you slurp it and it tastes better? I don't think I've slurped a hot drink, hot drink before. I've sipped it, like hot chocolate or a cup of tea. I don't think I've slurped a hot drink. Usually, when I have my tea in the morning or hot chocolate during like winter, I just kind of go straw. <laughs> I'm gonna slurp my next tea in the morning tomorrow. Oh, 
Oh, I see. I, uh, eat the cup. Eat the cup?! So, is, is the argument, like, slurping it makes the hot drink better? Or slurping it, does it make them better? Oh, it, it, is, is that the question? So this oh. is supposedly the dozing mattress? Doesn't look mattressy. No way this is it. What? Seriously, don't stare at me. Where is it? You said the dozing mattress was here. The only thing here is an old, weird-looking log chunk. M my knowledge is honest and true. It must be somewhere around here. Hmm? Perhaps a dream point? Hmm. Might be. In that case, something must be off in the dream world. Correct. It must be so. We should delve in. Okay. Bro, that's a fucking log. <laughs> yeah, I always slurp it because I swear it tastes better. So it's like the experience of drinking makes the taste better for you. So like slurping it instead of like sipping it is... I guess for you, just for you it's just like, hmm, it tastes better. My family thinks it's a ton of horse... <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I mean, that, that, that could be true. It could be said with, like, eating and drinking. There's, like, different ways of eating and drinking that makes you have more enjoyment out of it. I mean, actually, oh, to be fair, uh, for me, it's, like, when I take... If I have, like, a cake, for example, I, I did this a lot. Uh, I talked about this with my friends and family when I was younger. If I had a piece of cake, uh... And I used a spoon to eat it. I wouldn't use a big tablespoon. I'd use a big teaspoon. And my excuse was I get more enjoyment out of it. Because, you know, that, that's how I ate it. I technically got more bites out of it because I used a smaller spoon. If that makes sense. Find some clues in this dream. We're going to the dream world. What about you? Do you have any? Uh, do you have any food things that you do to make food taste better? Um, I'm not sure how to classify it. More like uh, unusual eating habits when I'm not out. When you're not out. <laughs> like I'm the type of person that eats pizza on the bread crust first, and then everything else. Oh because well, like you, you eat the crust first. Mm -hmm. And then everything, because the crust is my... I'm a person that I eat the least favorite parts first to have the best part at, towards the end. I do that with only one meal, and that is roast. Like, I'll, I'll eat the... Like, I, I love my roast dinner, it's my favorite meal, but I'll eat the, my least favorite things first and then get to the best part. But with other food, it's just, I'll eat the best thing first. However, I like how I've already spawned the confusion. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's not anything special, it's just. Mm -hmm. You're just enjoying the crust first. I cannot believe we're having an actual serious conversation about slurping drinks. Only on Mike Tento streams will the conversations get very. Oh, it's Remy! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Remy! gonna burn your hands on the pizza yeah how do you hold the pizza nor like on the it's not usually not as hot to like not be able to hold it see that's where i couldn't do that because i usually eat the pizza uh, not long after it comes out of the oven so i eat the pizza when it's quite warm oh jesus christ i mean i do too i still hold it <laughs> I'm gonna die of this thing, Jesus Christ! Oh, I have used a knife and fork before because sometimes it's not nice to have very oily hands. Oh no, I've, I've, look, I've never used a knife and fork with pizza. You, look, look, you gotta have an open mind. Oh yeah, I'm not saying people can't eat ways that, you know, different to mine.
I'm talking more to chat. Oh. <laughs> no, it ran away. Damn it. I know why the crust is there. That doesn't change the way I eat my pizza. <laughs> just look, look. Someone just said slurping makes their drink better. <laughs> that is, you can't judge me for the pizza thing. Because that just makes pizza better for me. So. <laughs> I mean, she is, she is right. This is the pizza box. <laughs> well, the pizza box tastes nice. You never know. Hey, if you're hungry for some cardboard, I guess. Sure. Yeah, exactly. I <laughs> had a rude trip, I'm not going to say it. You know what? <laughs> as, as a child, I still sometimes do it, but a lot, lot less. But I would also sometimes take apart the burger because uh, like the, the middle part was the best part of it. <laughs> <laughs> I want just the middle meat. <laughs> I don't want the rest of the burger. I would eat the bread first off the burger. <laughs> like, like, like the bottom of the burger first, then the top of the burger, and then anything in the... <laughs> <laughs> Look, like I said, this made the thing taste better. I love telling the food stories because I love the reactions. Yeah, <laughs> the reactions from food stories is the best because that's, that's the one. That if usually food stories are the ones you get the most reactions out of. It's great. This is so funny. I've had people though genuinely like, um, trying to to, um, uh, what's it called? Like, trying so hard to correct me on my stuff. You can't and really... It, 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 why? It yeah. does not hurt you. It, it, it is... It does not hurt you, so... You think that's a salt, meat, and bread? Yeah, I'm... I'm it just made it taste better. <laughs> it goes from layer to layer. I just mow them all in my beginning chunk. Exactly, you know, it's, 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 it's a layered burger. Yeah, no, I, ha I I remember clearly I had someone trying to correct me the way I eat pizza. Like, genuinely was really upset with the way I eat the pizza. <laughs> Why? And I'm like, what the fuck? Nothing to do Why? with you, bro. <laughs> Why is your biggest concern? Yeah, it's like it has nothing to do with you, bro. <laughs> fuck off. I mean, I've seen a bunch of... Oh, le like, obviously... I have, uh, like, um, what's it called, or a part of, like, my relative size comes from, aside come from Italy, so, uh, it, it, you know how, like, people roast certain ways to eat spaghetti? I've seen various ways of how people eat spaghetti. <laughs> I know that there's also certain things where, 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 oh, you eat spaghetti like this, and everyone... Play it. I don't know, seems like, oh my god, a, a child has been shot of, like, how... <laughs> you how, eat spaghetti how, like how, this? How could you? How devastated they were. Because I remember my brother could not really eat the spaghetti as a whole, so they, we would cut the spaghettis up. Apparently, for some people, this is a war crime. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I've never thought of cutting kind of spaghetti, but I don't think it's a problem. <laughs> I was like, how do you eat spaghetti? What, did you just pick up with your hands? Like, mine. Especially like, for a small child that may, you know, be clumsy. Yeah, oh, you work. never know. But some people just prefer it, so... The very first thing with finger I, I, of hubba bubble like, bubble gum tape, I just uh, massive yeah. chunk it off. <laughs> you know, I like my spaghettis long just because I like twirling them up. I like it long is... spaghetti, so I can just go... It's like up one noodle. Yes. Yeah, that too. But I like rolling up because it—I don't know—it—it—it it, it, it is, it is, uh, it is like a stimming while eating in that sense, or meditate. I don't know what to call it. It's meditation. <laughs> You're meditating while eating noodles. Using fucking orange juice instead of milk for cereal. What? What? No. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I have at least not met a person that like used orange shoes. I would that is one thing that would definitely look funny and that it look funny in a person, but you know, whatever floats their boat, so <laughs> I do know 
one of the weirdest stuff because I, I know I cook weirdly. I I am not normal while cooking. I'm not like anything dangerous or over the top. But uh, my roommate said it's very entertaining to watch me cook sometimes, so... <laughs> um, but... There is a friend of mine. I was not there in person. We just heard it through uh, the messages. Um, they uh, said they, they quote-unquote cooked an egg in the microwave. <laughs> Which not only is a kind of a cooking crime, it's also fucking dangerous. Please don't do that at home. Yeah, please don't try that at home. She did not have an issue, but uh, it could have turned out differently. So... <laughs> Also, I've had Dan watch me to cook, and he says it's, uh, heartbreaking. <laughs> I mean, isn't he a professional he's, cook? Yes, anyway? he, he's a professional cook, so watching me, a complete newbie, cook is like, oh my god, stop. <laughs> stop. Hello. Also, I, I read your thing, Ninkle, well, hold on. Uh, some people just have fits when things aren't done the way they want it, no matter what the thing is, even if it doesn't affect them. Yeah, no, people all get butt hurt for no reason. <laughs> hmm, wonder if someone has ever burnt water. I have. New example of this is my grandpa. Me and my mom used to, to put mine on chili because it cools it down and makes it better, but he hates how it looks and what refused to eat it at the table. We did it so we had to stop. Oh, that's because there is in. Um, I'm not sure. I assume it may be uh, common for Japanese dishes, considering it uses Japanese mayo. But there is something called spicy mayo. In fact, indeed, and it's actually really tasty. Spicy mayo. In general, Japanese mayo is really fucking delicious. Tasty. Yes, because they use the um, uh, egg yolk. They do not use the egg white for me. <laughs> they just oh, yolk. Ah, yes. Also, my, my reaction to when an enemy appears in the background is basically just a dog. Why? I'm just like, what the f <laughs> I'm gonna raise my head. Like, what the hell is that in the background? <laughs> I'm also gonna burn more. It's not burnt worse. I mean, anything burnt kind of. Smells oh Yeah. On the topic of back cooking ideas, there was once a really dumb five minute crafts cooking channel that once had a recipe for white spray, Mary's ingredients, and strawberries and bleach. Okay. Do not not bleaches are <laughs> I was posted to YouTube for kids to see oh my god, taken down. At least it was taken down, but oh my god. YouTube kids, I swear, do not get the right stuff on their freaking YouTube. I mean, YouTube in general has their priorities not straight, so. No. Some people, I swear to God. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Whole channel was killed after a month or so. Good. <laughs> that put a lot of kids at danger, probably. But yeah, no, 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 I mean, there's already a bunch of dumb challenges online anyway. Apparently, there's a recent whole chip challenge where you eat, like, a really, really, really salty chip. Really? And I guess you, you, you see how many you can eat, which, uh... Ow. May give you some salt poisoning. Oh, fun! Sometimes you gotta know when a challenge is just too much. <laughs> Alright, the battle ring, which is somewhere in Pilo Castle, boasts some really rare items. A battle ring, you say? <laughs> Get me up in that arena right now. Many good things, everything besides your turn. I would also say your external organs as well. <laughs> yeah. I would not touch bleach with my skin. <laughs> Please, do not touch bleach. <laughs> do not drink it, do not consume it. It is not edible nor drinkable. I also would want to avoid it as best as I can for, like, hair colouring, because it can go south really quickly as well. Mm. Thankfully that's happened to me mm. yet. 
Uh, more in terms that, you know, uh, depending on I think how you do it, your hair can get, or how often, your hair can get really brittle. And ac actually also, like, fall out. So. My hair must be very resilient then, because I've had my hair bleached since I was in high school, so over a decade. <laughs> Do you bleach? You only bleach your sides, don't you? Because you're red and uh, no, the red black. the red gets bleached too. Okay. Every so often, not every time I get a haircut, but like, I think oh, I can't remember how often it, it it does get bleached. So you maybe your hair has enough to recover in between, like enough time. My hair is strong. <laughs> It's more like, and I'm thinking of like, uh, you probably need to do it a lot more often. I know that like for uh, people that aren't like show business that get their hair bleached or colored every so often, they, I think they really suffer. Ah, uh, fair. Mike's natural red head, he bleached his sideburns. Ah yes, <laughs> my red is my natural hair color. I feel bad, I said it, I said it to, I said that to a student once and they believed me. <laughs> I mean, now when I had the, you know, the copper red people thought I was a natural redhead. <laughs> so I think, uh, depending on what color I pick, I can pass as a redhead, apparently. Fair. If Mike ever goes back to blonde, it's gonna feel so weird. Or what, if, if my hair was just, like, back to completely blonde? Bleach hair makes it easier for the color to pop. Uh, I bleach my hair every once in a while and usually dye my fringe slash bangs blue. Yeah, that's why that's why the red part of my hair gets bleached so it's easy. Yeah, it makes, makes the red. It's all just a bunch of beds. Where's the ring? Where's the tournament? I want to fight. <laughs> Yoshi! Wow. Oh my god, the Yeah, where's the ring? Where's the battles? I want to fight. my hair blue, but the hair was too dark. Oh, that's unfortunate. Aww. Oh, you. Where's tournament? Greetings. A nice day is 10 coins. I don't want to stay. I want to fight. I won't be you. You're looking for a place to stay at night? No, I'm not! for a place to do battle. Get yeah, Emily. Seems like they're stopping that one chip challenge. It's supposed to only be for adults who can handle spicy food, but some people have been ignoring the warning. That's also a thing. When you do challenges like that and people just ignore the warning, it's like, dude. Mm -hmm. Uh, none of these. I want to know where the tournament. Where's the ring? Where's the ring? None of these. Where's the ring? You. Where's ring? Sports ring. Where's ring? Uh, none of these. The ring. <laughs> Oi, animal abuser. Where's the ring? I sleep somewhere, I'll meet someone powerful. Where, 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 where is the sleep point? I wish to sleep and fight powerful people. I want to fight the strongest. Uh, none of this, go away. I wish to do battle, where is the thing? Ah, he's like, fine, I'll learn about stuff. Okay, I'm Second floor. Walk into the hotel room. Alright, not for you then. Now I need to talk to the other guy. What about the other floors? What about the third floor? What's on the third floor? Where is this ring you speak of? Third. Maybe a balcony area. Not very spacious, true. Very popular with tourists. Basement? No VIP, I'm afraid, which means my apologies. I'm afraid members of the public are. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> Where's the ring? 
It's not here. I already went in here. So what am I talking about? What do you say? Okay, you're useless. It's somewhere in Pilo Castle. I'll have to explore Pilo. Let me check. Let me see. No, wrong one. Where have I not been yet in Pilo Castle? Aha! There's two things up here. Ha 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 ha. Let me up here. I wish to find this thing. I'm going to destroy anyone. I'm about to punch the workers. I want to get in. <laughs> this is an arena. This is a diner. Ooh, coin. Oh, coin. Block. What's in here? Bunny. <laughs> oh, they both lead to the same place. But over here. Oh, a ring. This room. I wonder what it's for. It's pretty wild here. It's as if most of the castle has changed, but this area remains the same. Dreambird, do you know what this place? Of course. Remember, this castle originally belonged to me. I'll be your tour guide. Please try to keep up. If you enjoy a good challenge, you'll love the Battle Ring! Here you'll dream about fighting fists and foes you've encountered. But they'll be even stronger than before. you also get prizes for defeating them. Enter the Battle Ring, yeah! The challenge of your dreams await. Let me in. Fight, 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 fight. Wait, wait, wait. wait. You're fighting. I found the Battle Ring. Uh, you found the battle ring on oh my And goodness. I get to fight Mario! Vital news. As you know, this place lets you fight enemies from past battles. But if you win battle class 1, you'll get the Sea Keeper's Feathers as a prize. Go forth, beat the foe in battle class 1, and win the Sea Keeper's Feathers. Yes, I want to do it. Grobot X. I'm gonna fuck him up. I did not I did not read the conditions, but I'm gonna fight him. Get him! Six turns? Oh, I'm gonna fuck him up. Poor Luigi, you can't use most of his moves because they're motion control. Could not, I couldn't even react to that move. That was so fast. What the hell? Ah! Man was fast. Yeah, was like no reaction time whatsoever. Two turns, nice. <laughs> I'm a quick lady at me. Okie dokie, love. GG, easy clap. I know, right? Literally beat him on turn two. Amazing! You got the special prize, the Sea Keeper's Feathers. Yeah! Let's head back to the real world and report to Starlo. Man only a bronze, I know, right? Two turns, bronze. Welcome back, did you find anything? Wow, 
Those are gorgeous feathers. Well, they do belong to the legendary sea keeper. Legend has it that if the feathers tickle you, you fall asleep instantly. Once those things get made into a blanket or something, just think of how great you'll sleep, Luigi. I'm so jealous. In fact, it's so comfortable, many people never wake up. I take that back. I take back what I said about being jealous. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Can you do that to me for real, for real? I know, right? Just go tickle, tickle. Look at the menu about the bath parts. Okay, so where are we going next for the... Uh... Looks like we are on to the... Uh, Mush Rice Park has been mostly abandoned, but perhaps someone knows something about the Mush Rice Tree Board. <laughs> Mush Rice Park, here we go! Froze, <laughs> for you just... <laughs> Dies! I've been punching. Ah, I've dropped him. I've punched him. Now I'm Mush Rice Park. Okay. Uh, let's see here. We can probably go over this way, over to the right. <laughs> Thank you, River. This is the little Mario clap. <laughs> jump, jump, jump. Oh, jump, jump. <laughs> Thank you. Ba -da 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 -da. I can get up here, boingy. <laughs> can I go up there? Boing! No, I can go up there. Watch this. I cannot go up there. Help! 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 Okay. Did I ever go that way? Oh, yeah, I can't go the bridge. Oh my god, the end of this month is going to be confused by the three of the same clip. <laughs> yeah, that's soon. I'm going to have to get to work on. I'm going to have to do another clips of the month. Soonish. Oh, I see. Something's happened. Hmm. What's a fella to do? Got it. I'll ask those guys. Yeah, that's it. Might remember the names. No. But what? Wait a tick. Where are them guys? Hmm. Me? Are you talking about moi? Me? I'm here. Hello. Bah. It's you guys. Good timing. I've got a little favor to ask. Sorry, but we're busy looking for something. Oh, you guys are always looking for something. What do you got in mind this time, huh? A mushroom tree board, eh? You want to know if I've seen one around this park? <laughs> you know who you're talking to, buddy. Come on, I know this park like the back of my hand. So you do know about it? Where is it? 
But <laughs> I'll tell you, just as soon as you do me a favor. So we got a deal or what? Oh boy. Mario, Luigi, what do you think? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get to work. Huh, work? Here's what I want you to do. You ready? Rock clearing. Is that what you're paid your staff to do? Well, a bunch of monsters showed up in the time at the castle did. Me boys ain't eh, equipped it to deal with that kind of stuff. Where'd you put that with gun? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I see. Take a look at that map and I'll explain it to ya. Okay, here's where we are now. Let me show you where to break the rocks. There's, there are some round here. There was a tree blocking the path there. But my boys probably took care of it by now. There's more here too. In the... Okay, well, don't get to read it. There's a whole mess of rocks around here. Even if you youngsters have the trouble with them... Go break the rocks around the places I showed you. Don't matter where you start working from, but it's probably easier to start in the south end. I'll be waiting right here. Talk to me when you're done. Ashen Crosses asks favorite thing to do in your spare time that isn't playing games. People in the chat with me can answer too, BTW. Spare time. Stuff to do in the spare time. Um, honestly, probably exercising or meditating. I, I do that a lot. Uh, apart from playing games and I wouldn't call editing spare time like hobby. I, I guess it's kind of a hobby, but also work. Um, I, I, I do like to exercise. I do like to go out in the garden and like just meditate or just enjoy the outdoors. Uh, I like walking. I think that's pretty cool. Sleep. <laughs> Remove the tree that was blocking the path. But now there's a bunch of monsters around. We really need to get rid of all the rocks though. Worshipping ducks. Honestly, I know like if I had one, it'd be like pet. I will eventually get a pet at some point. What about you though, uh, Ashen, as well as other people in chat? What, what, what do you do in your favorite spare time? That isn't playing games, I guess. Well, you say you look burly enough to do the job. We really appreciate your help. Right, didn't you get a whole set of Halloween ducks? I did, just to send two to Snake and also give one to Yuna. Hmm. Modding games, that's fair. YouTube. Your tubs. You know, it's a fly guy. Pretty fly for a shy guy. But they're blue now, which means they're stronger. Ow. Ow. Okay, I see. Oh, you in the background! Get your ass over here, son! Probably sports, I'm gonna lie. Sports are nice. <laughs> what I do in my spare time is honestly drawing and cooking, even if it's, uh, art's my job. That's kind of saving me and you, like, editing videos. It's kind of my job, but I also enjoy doing it. It's been tickled. Don't want to do much, just play games, watch YouTube, and help take care of my mum. Fair enough, fair enough. Responsibilities. I nearly read Stream Elements message there. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> I see, I see. Okay. And swimming, I love going swimming. Oh, dude, swimming was fun. I haven't been, well, I went swimming when Yuna came over, but that was like once in like several years. Swimming is so nice, actually.
Are you enjoying going on walks? Yeah, same. No, I, I enjoy walks too. Swimming's nice though. I would like to go swimming again, but in a pool that has, uh, like, it's a bit deeper so I can actually go under the water and stuff like that. Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum. So I, if I were a Pokemon trainer, I'd be a water type trainer. Fair. I mean, for me, it's obvious. If I were to pick one trainer, I'd be a fire type uh, user. I mean, I did that in the DLC for uh, Indigo Disc for um, Scarlet and Violet. I had my fire type Pokemons. Okay, let's have a look here. Water type for me. Wah. Shared love, me and my sister adore being in the sea. Oh, that sounds awesome. Swimming is fun. I, I do enjoy swimming. For me, it's just like, I have a phobia of the things that are in the water. <laughs> oh, there's two more rocks in here, I see. Well, for me, the phobia of sharks. I was like, but for me in the sea, it's like, I like swimming. I don't want to come across a shark though. <laughs> Like, it's an actual phobia. Conquering it would be difficult. Yo, Luigi. Mike fish in the water. <laughs> That'd be a new phobia. <laughs> the Mike fish staring back at me. Ah, it's me, but fish, exactly. Perish, 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 perish. Smash! As well, my love for might come from what I suppose that he was in the past life. I suppose he was a pirate in the past life. Yar, you be a pirate in the past life, do ye? Stored version of yourself in the form of your greatest fear, Mike Fish. <laughs> There's two more rocks in this bottom right area. Oh, 
All right, you're welcome, little little one. All right. Uh, where are these two rocks? all the rocks in this area and there's nowhere to go from here so <laughs> yar har yar har be baity ye be sailing for that booty for that treasure how you say it yar <laughs> give me being the Visitors, I'm terribly sorry. I'm afraid I only parked stuff right out the past this point. We store fairly important items back there, you see. Very boring, honest. You'll find you'll find better sites elsewhere. Aww. All right, back I go, I guess. So how do I get to the other area that he was talking about? I wonder. Oh, <gasps> it's the Binions! Guys, look, it's the Binions! They're back! Chat, it's your favorite thing to come from this, this game! The Binions! Look at them! They're back! The Binions are back! <laughs> we have taken out the Binions! Can't begin my senses if I feel like they're going haywire. Fair, fair. Alright, bye, Binions. We'll leave the Binions be now. Chats at the Binions. Okay, there's nine rocks in here. Well, hey, is that technically an official Binions in the form of a minion chicken? Huh. Minion chicken, that sounds... Oh, it's a binion! <laughs> oh, what? Ah, I can bounce up here. To op I can bounce up here, but doingy. Yeah, get your frick... Oh, wait, that's the wrong one. Binion. Bouncy! Hello, can I get past? Sorry, but I can't allow you to go beyond this point. There are boulders and nasty monsters all over. Eh? Boss Brickle sent you here? You came here to help with Curse the Rocks? Well, that's fantastic. Be careful out there. Thanks, dude. Okay, how do I... Alright. Can I bounce up there? Damn it. Rock. 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 There are six rocks in this area. We must destroy rock. I'm going in. Rock. Three more rocks. Take it that's these rocks up here that I can't destroy right now. I'm gonna need something else. Oh, hello. Working on living shiny star decks in DLC as well. Guess uh, how lines I have complete right now. Oh, the shinies of the starters? If you're living. If it, if it, <laughs> we're getting a living shiny starter Pokemon. I'm gonna guess you have. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna guess about 15. 15. Close? Oh, where is it? 19? Oh wow, I was close. <laughs> Um, I'll make this one turn to blue. Your turn. No. Turn you yellow. Ah. Ah. I'm tiny. Mini Luigi. Missing Scott, Ultra Gavita, Turtle, Snivy, Fennekin, and Gen 9 stars. You're getting, you're getting quite far then. No fair, you're all blue. That would have, like, took them all out, but that one perished by normal means. My present? Wow, super box! What's your guys' favorite shiny starter Pokemon? Oh, oh boy, this looks interesting. Eevee. Yeah, yeah, I guess EV counts. For me, it's probably basic, but it's the final uh, evolution of Charmander's Charizard. But Greninja's is also pretty cool. I think Fennekin's is also pretty adorable. Uh, I'm trying to think of the shinies now, the starters. I can't remember most of them very well. I see.
do 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 Charles has one of the top ones for me. Mine's probably Hisu in Samurai. I don't think I've seen Hisu in Samurai's shiny. That's, I'm interested in how that looks now. Glass hammer. How does a glass hammer work? May break during use? <laughs> Literally a glass hammer. Based on the number of coins you have, okay. Screw it, yeah. <laughs> Use a glass hammer and make it break. Actual glass. The, the the random weapons in this game sometimes. There's one that is specifically stronger on your birthday, making it like a 400 times power increase, which is like, hello? <laughs> 400% sorry, uh, power increase. That's just like <laughs> power. Okay. Yo, durability. <laughs> they added durability to a Mario and Luigi game. Uh, okay, I don't want to take that just yet. Because there's three more rocks in this area, which I need to find. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, they're over there. I see. <laughs> Woohoo! Nice. Oh, no. Ba bum 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 ba da dum dum. One. Huh, <sighs> that's all that's the last of the rocks. Let's go tell Brickle that we're done. Then he'll give us the mush rice tree board. Yeah, I'm sure he has it. Chat, do you think he has it? I don't think he has it. Boing. No, I don't think he does either. So that's all does. Shit. Bank your bank. Bonk. Bonk. Bobby has a mushroom, uh, mushroom taped to the wood. <laughs> this isn't what I asked for at all, you sleazy little dirtbag. I want the actual thing. Come here. Oh. You guys got good news for me. Tell me you went and broke all them rocks. That's what I'm talking about. I knew you guys had it in ya. A deal's a deal. Follow me. Oh, it's probably the area I couldn't go down to. Come on, fellas. It's probably where he's taking me. Boop, 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 boop. This way. Okay. Yeah, I put these rocks for you. There you go. There you go. Look at that. Your rocks are broken. I'll take it from here. Yes, sir. The treasure's this way. I'll go first and wait for you. Treasure. Trap. Mm. Treasure. Just treasure, no, 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 no monsters wanting to harm me, just treasure. <gasps> treasure, wow, it's actually just there. Okay, ready? This is what you've been looking for. The mush rice tree board. It's not even cursed. This, 
Is the mush rice tree pod? Well, uh, yeah, of course, I think. Hmm. You don't know? You made us do all that manual labor and you didn't know if this was the mush rice tree board? Hey now, what well, was I supposed to know what to know? Oh, sure, convenient. Back when this park was still a big muddy field, I found this thing while I was tilling the soil. Yep, my life hadn't been going so hot back then. I came to this island to get a fresh start, you know? I thought maybe if I pa <laughs> Hello. Hello, welcome back. Mario and Luigi have fallen asleep because this guy spoke a lot. Any you, that was the uh, that, that was round that time I found this board. Don't look no look the ordinary board, do it. Nah, there's definitely something special about it. I think. Allow me to take a look. Why don't we just get you to come look at it the first place? Hmm. The rich texture in this unique luster. This elegant shape. There's no doubt about it. The mush rice tree board. Ha! I knew it. No, you, no, you didn't. Yeah. Now that we're square, I gotta get back to work. Thank you, Mr. Prickle. I was just thinking that. Yeah, just get Dreambird to come look at it first. He would know. This one wasn't even cursed. Nice. The mush rice tree board looks kind of weird. Dreambird, did that board really come from a tree? Yes. Legendary must rice tree grow in, this, grow in this area. This board is the only thing left after the tree decays. The tree turns into a board when it dies? Incredible. I hate to say it, but Brick already came through for us. True. Now let's find the other part of the bed. Yes, we can look at it at the menu. Thank you for telling me every single time I get one. How you doing, love? I'm doing good. I just brush my toothpaste. <gasps> you brush your teeth? Yes. I brush the brush. You brush your teeth? I brush them. That is the last piece, because we need one more piece. But I'm probably going to end stream today for now, because it is getting late. Uh, it is in Driftwood Shore. Okay, that's where we're going next time. There is a pipe just down below us. But I am going to save here, and I'm going to end stream here. Because I've been going for nearly three hours, apparently. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> and it is getting late. I want to make sure I spend a little bit of time with Yoon uh, before oh. EPs. So, I'm going to get a full screen. Hello. I'm going to end stream here tonight. So, thank you for coming and watching. <laughs> thank you, Yoon, for joining me as well in the voice while you were here. Of course. It was lovely to have you. Uh, let me check if anyone is streaming. Oh, uh, someone I know who I've watched a couple of times on Twitch, uh, Epi, they've appeared in my streams a couple of times too in chat. They're currently streaming Splatoon 3. So, we can go raid them. Go give them some, uh, Luma loves mic tender energy. Time just goes at, it does, it really does. Alright, so... Oop, I need to do it correctly. Da -da -da, na -na -na -na. All right, go. We're gonna raid uh, Epi here. Go give them some. His channel has follower or subscriber only chat. All right, well there you go. It has that. But go give them some Mike Tendo energy. Go give them some Luma love. Uh, they're pretty cool. They play Splatoon. They have they have good energy. Uh, I've watched their stream before. They're pretty cool. Oh, they're currently playing. 50, 50, they're currently playing Fifty Two Gal. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. No, I'm joking. Go, go, give them some good energy. Go, give some love. I'll see you all next time, probably Wednesday, for some more, um, probably more of this. Probably some more Mario and Luigi Dream Team. Take care. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Bye. Bye. -bye.